Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, this is a big money Bolo video. I am gonna share with you big money Bolo items that I sold on eBay. Items that I sold for $35 or more. Um, or more is hopefully what they will be. But um, we're gonna check those out here shortly. But um, I'm gonna tell you where I got it, what I paid for it, and what I sold it for. Before I do that, I'm going to give you guys a quick List Perfectly demo video um, of how I use List Perfectly. I'm just going to pick three items and I am going to cross post them from eBay to Mercari and Poshmark. For anybody that's interested in a cross posting service, this is the one I use. I love it. It saves me so much time. And I just thought I would just do a quick demo right at the beginning of the video because. Um, this is a shorter video on how many, uh, I think I only have like 10 or 12 Bolo items in this one. So I didn't uh, piece it out right. So uh, the other one had more than this one. So I'm just gonna show you a quick demo. How about it? Yeah? All right. And if you wanna try list perfectly, you can use coupon referral code Bolo Buddies, all one word, that'll get you 30% off your first month. And if you wanna see a longer, more extensive video, not super long, but longer of how it works, there's one down in the description. But I'm just gonna show you real quick. So let's get the screen share up. We're gonna do three items, that's it, super fast. Um, I'm gonna pick, so let me show you here what I do is I use this custom label. So I'm gonna pick the items and I'm gonna add PM and MC, that stands for Poshmark and Mercari. And it will take me a little bit longer because I'm going to explain things to you. But the tote is where I have it and this is where I picked it up and what I paid for it. So I'm gonna submit that so that it's ready. And I'm gonna do this one. Let's see, let's do, I'm trying to do the higher priced ones. Uh, let's do this one here. And again, I'm just gonna pick three. And these are like the infinity game pieces. And we'll do this one here. So I've got Alice in Wonderland. I've got the Marvel lot and then the inside out characters. So I'm gonna hit start selecting and I'm gonna pick the three that I just put custom SKUs in. And I usually do 20 to 25 at a time, but for um, this video, I'm just gonna do the three. And then I'm going to hit it again. This is going to pop up. These are all the places that you can list to. And I'm actually going to just, um, I was going to try something, but I'm going to do that on my own. Let's do Mercari, Mercari and Poshmark. And these are all the places you can cross post to. So it's pretty amazing. But I'm going to hit copy. And then you can see here, um, I pay $49 a month. And that gets me eligible to bulk cross post, which is what I'm doing right now. I'm doing more than one at a time. Now, if I only had the $29 a month, I could do one item, but I could cross post it to all the platforms at the same time if I wanted. But um, this one is just, I'm doing the three items all at once. So that's for the $49 a month. That's one of the features. And I'm not gonna go into all of the different features for the different levels. You can check out the video in the description for that. I'm just gonna show you how quick this is. Okay, so my items are now pulled up on Mercari and Poshmark. So here's Mercari, Poshmark, Mercari, Poshmark, Mercari, Poshmark. So now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna fill in the information. Um, so I'm gonna put Disney, Infinity. The tags, you just have to fill in. Now, I don't use the catalog, I could, um, and it may be something I look into in the future, but right now, this is how I like to do it. So I'm just gonna do accessories. Disney Infinity, The who do you want to pay for the shipping? I'm gonna pay, I'm gonna do free shipping. And let's see, I'm gonna do, okay, this is a Mercari glitch, come on. There we go, um, ship on your own. And I have I have the buyer pay shipping on eBay, so I'm gonna up this, which one is this? I'm just gonna up it to 22 and that gives me, well, they say that the price is anywhere between 15 and 27. So you know what, I'm gonna do 25, that way I can do price drops and I can take offers. 
Um, I'm going to turn smart pricing off and then I'm going to hit list. And there they are. So now they're on Mercari. I'm going to go over to Poshmark and I'm going to do the same thing. Um, I'm going to change the title slightly. I'm going to go into kids, toys, action figures, and play sets. Um, I'm going to put boys one size, new with tags. No, I'm not going to fill in the color. Um, oh, uh, this is new style tags. Huh. That's something Poshmark has added. I'm not familiar with that. I'm just going to leave it blank for now. And they do suggested price also now on Posh. And you also have discount options, which is also new. I'm going to do no discount. They can send me an offer. And since I put it for 25 on the other, I'll put it 22 here. And I'll just kind of play around with those uh, numbers. All right. So now that's up on Poshmark. So now we've got Alice in Wonderland. So I'm going to put Alice Disney Infinity. And um, let's see. Accessories for games. It's an electronics accessory. Um, good condition. And I'm going to pay. Ship on my own. And she's a little bit harder to find. So I'm going to put her at $38. And I'm going to list. And we'll see if I get an offer. If not, no big deal. I can lower the price. And tweak the title a little bit. We're going to go to kids, toys, action figures. I'm going to do girls for that one. One size, new with tags, no. Um, I'm going to put zero here. I'm going to change this to 35. And I am going to hit next. And that item is now listed. And again, if I'm not talking to you guys, I am super, super fast. Um, but I'm talking to you guys. So I'm a little bit slower. So Disney, Infinity, and I'm just going to use the word Marvel as my third. Um, this one didn't give me the option of electronics. So I'm just going to go with action figures. That works for me. They are in good condition. I'll pay. Ship on your own, save, and we're going to go with $37 because I'm doing free shipping. And I'm going to turn off smart pricing. I'm going to click list. And that one's ready to go. Now I'm going to do Poshmark. So when I get done here, I am going to have three items that were on eBay that are now on Posh and Mercari. Just that quick. And it is way, way quicker than manually cross-posting. And again, I should do it one time where I don't talk and I just focus like I would be. And then you guys could really see how quick it is. All right, so those three items are, are up. I have cross-posted them. Again, I use this perfectly and then I can just close out these tabs because I'm done. Close out that tab and we're back at the main screen and now I'm going to show you guys some bolo items. So the first bolo item I have, I found these at a thrift store. I believe they were a dollar and I just thought they were fantastic. They they are signed craft. Let me see if I can get you the it's only on one of the earrings, but it's signed craft. And I just thought the seashells were definitely like a winner. And they sold super fast and they sold for $40 and the buyer paid shipping. The next item are these Bacagon. Now, these are the Bacagon Battle Brawlers. I think these were, um, yeah, at a garage sale and I paid $8 for them. Now, the Bacagon that are smaller are the vintage ones. The bigger ones are the newer ones. Um, it's basically a magnetic card and it's a game. Some of the cards are magnetic, some are not. But if you sit that little character on top of the card, it transforms. So they're really, really cool. But I took a best offer of $100 on these and the buyer paid shipping. And I don't know if I took a picture of any of them open or not, but I did do the cards. 
so people could compare them because I wasn't gonna try to figure out if I had cards for every one of them. The next item came from my, um, not my, to from that, I was gonna say my video. Um, I had a video where I showed you guys my haul, uh, sourcing with Bolo Buddies. If you wanna check it out, it's over there. But I told you guys that I thought these were gonna be a Bolo and I was right. Um, and that was just uh, a guess, you know, as I do this and I work with toys, I'm starting to just have good feelings about things. And it's nice when you're right. You know what I mean? So it's super exciting. Then I can share that information with you guys. And I learned so much from you guys in the comments. Also, when you guys leave me little notes and tell me things, I appreciate that so much. And other people read those comments also. So it's really helpful. Um, but I got these at a thrift store. I paid a dollar for all of them. And they sold really quickly for $35. They're the Fisher Price Laugh and Learn Puppy, Monkey, Dog, and Frog. And they rattle their plastic toy figures. The next item is this Incredibles Baby Jack-Jack. Okay, right now, after the video, you have to go over to my channel called Reseller Testing Products and watch this video. This doll is crazy. Um... And it sold for full asking price of $41.25 plus shipping. I picked this up in a Facebook Marketplace haul. If you want to see what else I got, I have uh, two videos. It's called Facebook. I got it on Facebook for $50 or something like that. It was two parts because I got so much stuff for 50 bucks. So definitely check out those videos also. Okay, these vintage 4th of July lights. These were actually in on my original Bolo Buddies channel, the one you're at, I went to a thrift store, I did a thrift haul and everybody was like, you need to go back and get those 4th of July lights. So I went back and they were still there and I bought them. Paid $7.50 for them and I did take a best offer of $40 and they did take a little while to sell, but I was glad I went back because you guys told me to go back and then they sold. So um, like I said, I learned from you guys, you learn from me, It's it's awesome. So thank you all for being here and for watching. All right, the next item I sold is this Playmates Retired Doll. I did take a best offer of $35 for her and I picked her up at a garage sale for $2. All right, these came out of my box that it was a vintage toy box that I purchased from Auctions For You. It's a YouTuber and her link is down in the description if you guys need inventory. Her and Donatella Bottolino, Mr. Buys A Lot. There's a lots of good great ways to source on YouTube. Um, but this was a vintage toy box that I bought from auctions for you for a hundred dollars. And I messaged her and I said, I'd like a hundred dollar mystery toy box. And these little glow guys sold for a best offer of $64. So they're 1985 vintage Hasbro glow worm glow friends, puppet figures glow in the dark and they fit on your fingers and they glow in the dark. They're super cool and the buyer paid shipping. The next item I thought was going to be more of a bolo than it was, it is a print. It's a vintage Little Red Riding Hood print by Raffaello Busani, and it's framed. And I got this at a thrift store. I did pay up, paid $10 for it, and I took a best offer of 38. So not the margins that I typically get, but I just thought it was so adorable. So I had to wait on the right buyer. It was long tail also. The next item I sold is this brooch lot. It's 20 brooches. These came from my bulk buy. I bought it on eBay to sell on eBay. I have a playlist on that if you guys want to check out the 344 pounds of jewelry that I purchased. But this lot sold for a best offer of $45 and the buyer paid shipping. The next item is this stamp. I got this at a thrift store and a lot of stamps. So I had about a quarter in it and it's rubber stampede rare cat san francisco but it's a cliban stamp that is where the money's at it is cliban cat 1991 i sold this for 46 dollars 80 and the buyer paid shipping the next item is this pyrex piece i picked it up at a thrift store for three dollars it did have the lid it's a casserole ditch dish a 1.5 quart and i got a lot of action on this actually once i listed it and um, I did an auction style. It did not sell, but it had watchers. So I did a buy it now at a higher price. And I had quite a few offers come in. And I finally took an offer of $45 and the buyer paid shipping. 
The next item is this Disney Infinity Portal Base and Xbox. And I picked up these things and a bunch of the Infinity things that I just cross posted. I paid $10 for all of it. And this right here, this part, the two games and this thing, the portal sold for $37.50 plus shipping. So I was really excited about that. And it sold within like three or four days. The next item is this huge lot of girls toys. And this is what I call a toy box. And this is what I call Bolo Buddies gets tired and she's sick of listing toys. So she throws them all in a box. And there's a lot of really good stuff in here. This can definitely be parted out and sold individually. Um, a lot of bread and butter. It's going to take some time. But you guys know I list tons of bread and butter. But this one I lotted up. And I sold this for $64. And I took a best offer. And a subscriber, viewer, and now friend bought this off of me. It is um, was purchased by Chosen Goods reseller and she just started a youtube channel so you guys head on over there and show her some love with a sub all right you guys uh thanks for being here thanks for watching be sure to like comment subscribe and share check out my sourcing with bolo buddies youtube channel and again if you're interested in trying list perfectly that referral coupon code is bolo buddies one word you can message me in the comments if you have a question you can message me on facebook if you have a question Again, I'm not using the catalog and I should be because um, it has this great feature where if the item sells, you can go in and click delist and it will pull it up in the tabs and then you just delist the items from list perfectly. It's way quicker than manually doing it, but I manually do it and it works great for me. Um, I, I like starting on eBay and then cross posting to the other two. And I tell you guys all the time, the reason I like that is because I list during the day and then at night I will sit down and I will watch, I will listen to YouTube while I cross post. So I'm kind of like educating, getting educated by listening to YouTube or I'm watching the YouTube auctions, trying to get some deals while I'm doing lists perfectly. So I'm always multitasking. So I like to start on eBay and then cross post at night before I go to bed. Uh, lately I've been doing YouTube before bed and, um, I'm a little behind on cross posting. So I'm really excited to get those three items on the other platform. And it kind of has given me some motivation to get busy because I can't sell on those other platforms if I'm not listing new stuff. So um, yeah, anyway, I love it. And I will say that um, I've been using it for over a year. I don't have anything bad to say about it. And I tell you guys, um, it's good. It's good. And the one thing that I keep getting from people that sign up, they're like, I should have done it sooner. So don't wait. Um, just try it. And if you don't like it, you can quit, right? But you won't. I bet you don't because it's awesome. All right, you guys, thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you at the next one.